When most businesses shut down during coronavirus, daycare centers kept their doors open. Our Christina Laurie is with us this morning to explain how they've managed. Hi, Christina. Hi, Chris and Leah. There have been no reported coronavirus outbreaks at Madison area daycare centers. And at a time when we're seeing cases spike at restaurants and bars, there's something that can definitely be learned from the businesses who are getting it right. Take Kinder Care on Madison's West Side, for example. On average, staff members there take care of a couple dozen kids every day. But even as the virus spread this spring and cases continue to climb, the center's director says there haven't been any reported cases at her facility. This could be in part because there are almost no recorded cases of child to adult transmission of the virus. An education policy expert wrote in op-ed explaining this is why reopening full-time child care and schools won't be too risky as long as administrators are also strict about their policies. Places like kinder care not only clean constantly, they don't allow anyone besides children in their building. Not even our team was allowed inside for this interview. Parents drop off their kids at the door. We take their temperature um, and we ask a few health questions. Have you had a fever? Have you... Um, have you had any sicknesses? And then we take them in, and then we also do wellness checks throughout the day. The director of kinder care says her center not only follows CDC guidelines, but they uh, extend them and comply with even more of their own. In our next half hour, I'll explain what some of those are and what school administrators can learn from the extra steps daycare staff has already been taking every day to successfully keep kids safe.